Good morning children. Today we are going to see the grammar topic reported speech. See here children. So in direct and indirect speech. So there are four kinds of sentences. What are they? Statement, interrogative, imperative and exclamatory. So what is statement? It gives an information. For example, the sun rises in the east. Okay, second one, the cow gives us milk. So, statement. Statement is nothing but giving an information. Second one is interrogative. Interrogative is nothing but asking questions. What is your name? Where are you coming from? Who are you? Likewise, so in interrogative, so I will be asking questions. Next, imperative. That is order or command or request. So, for example, Close the door immediately. Ordering. Next, request means please pass me the salt. So, ordering or requesting. It is imperative. Exclamatory is nothing but it's expressing sudden emotion and feelings. For example, what a beautiful flower it is. Okay, exclamatory sentence it is. Exclamation. So, what a beautiful Taj Mahal it is. So, expressing sudden feelings and emotions is called exclamatory. So, these are the four types of sentences. What are they? Statement. Second one is interrogative, imperative and exclamatory sentences. See here children, change is in the reporting verb. If said is coming means, so while you are changing into indirect, you have to use said. Said to, you have to change into told. Says, you have to write says. Says to, tells. So, while changing into indirect, you have to see these changes in the sentences. So, children see here, changes in time and place. So, if this is coming in direct speech, you have to change this into that. So, in direct la matamoludu, this is changed into that. These is changed into those. Now is changed into then, ago is changed into before, last night is changed into previous night, next day is changed into the following day, thus is changed into so. And also today is changed into that day, yesterday is changed into previous day, tomorrow is changed into the next day, next week is changed into the following week, last week is changed into the previous week, here is changed into there. So, it is another direct line. This is indirect You have to change these words. Okay, ba? Children, see the table here. So, four types of sentences are there. Statement, interrogative, imperative, exclamatory. Okay, ba? So, if say is coming in direct speech. Direct class say you have to change into say da. Say to means tell. Said means said. Okay, wa? says, abdina, you have to change it to says only. Says to tell, said to told. Conjunction in a use pannu, that use pannu. Interrogative, less, said means asked. Said to asked, asked also, if it is coming, you have to write as, as it is asked. Okay, wa? next imperative, said or said to one ordered or asked illa commanded requested advised according to the sentences you have to write next exclamatory less said to and the china exclaimed hurrah exclaimed joyfully alas exclaimed sorrowfully conjunction illat me have to use that so in imperative la inna use panano conjunction to you have to use don't and the china not to yet that is, you have to add. Okay, va? Just I'll say the example. Then you'll understand. Okay, va? Children, see here. So, this is statement. First type. Okay, va? See the example clearly. She said, I am going home. Okay, va? This is statement. Or vacuum. How will change? It is I am going. So, present continuous tense. Epume verb kuda ing vandadana. It is continuous. So, am. It is present continuous. Am is or vandichina present. Ilya was var vandichina past varu. So, she said. Conjunction next in add panano. That you have to add. So, am going. Here. I am going. Na pore. Abdina solranga. Directa solu bolde. Number na solu mau second person kita. Aunga pore anga. Apa I is changed into she. 
so am is changed into was going home so present continuous is changed into past continuous chiringla present continuous enna vaagu past continuous aagu so she said i am going home so the direct words so direct speech ku will be adding comma and quotations so while we are writing into indirect abina we should take that comma and quotations okay va so present continuous is changed into past continuous see this again one ram said to raj i am talking with her now this is also present continuous so present continuous is changed into past continuous so answer ram told raj that so after removing that command quotation you have to add the conjunction that so i abdina avaru appa he am is changed into was talking with her now is changed into then okay have you all understood the statement so present continuous is changed into past continuous okay va children she the next type interrogative okay she said to him is he mad avanga mad a ஓகே கேட்குறாங்க கொஷின் வியர் ஹி இஸ் ஆஸ்கிங் இஸ் ஹி மேட் மேடா பைத்தியமான் ஹி இஸ் ஆஸ்கிங் ஓகே ஷி ஆஸ்ட் ஹிம் செட் டு பதிலாக வாட் வி ஹாவ் டு யூஸ் ஆஸ்கட் ஷி ஆஸ்ட் ஹிம் இஃப் ஹூ இஸ் ஹி வாஸ் மேட் எப்போவுமே ப்ரெசென்ட் வந்துச்சுன்னா யூ ஹாவ் டு சேஞ்ச் தட் இன் டு பாஸ்ட் ஸோ ப்ரெசென்ட் கண்டினியூஸ் வந்தால் பாஸ்ட் கண்டினியூஸ் ஸோ சிம்பிள் ப்ரெசென்டன்ஸ் வந்துச்சுன்னா வி ஹாவ் டு சேஞ்ச் சிம்பிள் ப்ரெசென்ட் இன் டு சிம்பிள் பாஸ்ட் so she asked him if he was mad okay va question kekanu he said to her have you done the homework so he asked said to badla asked her so interrogative so we have to ask a question if she had done the homework okay so what is instead of her we are uh, adding had okay if she had done the homework next one he said to her who is your father so said to bella asked he asked her who her father was who is your father avungaloda father yaar who her father was okay interrogative question so simple present has changed into simple past adhe mari present perfect has changed into past perfect so present perfect enna vaagum past perfect aagum okay va have you all understood this one see the next one imperative so order command request ravi said to his driver drop me at my office so enna solranga driver kitta enna drop pannirunga abdina direct words avanga sonnadu ipa namba enna sollano ravi asked said to badala asked illa odd that is ordered abdi kuda vechikala so ravi asked his driver so imperative ku namma enna use pannanu to okay va so that is to drop me na yar avar ravi appa he drop him at my office avarude appa his avarude en solra pa at his office okay va so ravi asked his driver illa ravi ordered his driver to drop him at his office avarude en eludru my ingitta solra pa direct ah solranga nama avar solra nu solra pa his him use pandrom the teacher said to the students don't write both sides of the paper so answer the teacher ordered the students imperative number what we will be using ordered so requester ketanga na requested adu mari so the teach or asked adu mari kuda eludalam so according to the sentence you have to write this one ordered or requested or asked on the teacher ordered the students so don't don't vandichana nam enna use pananum not to not to write both sides of the paper so ange edu varla appa to use pandrom don't vanduchna what we we have to use not to so not to write both sides of the paper so this is imperative okay va children see the next exclamatory for example he said how beautiful the taj mahal is so always simple present has changed into simple past he exclaimed so idu now what uh, for a imperative we have used asked ordered commanded adu mari use panikalam exclamatory ku exclaimed aacharya padra vishayam exclamatory na so he exclaimed conjunction that the taj mahal was is ku badala was very beautiful that's all exclamation okay 
she said what a beautiful picture it is it is simple present we have to change into simple past she exclaimed that you have to add always conjunction it was a very beautiful picture so always have it in mind if simple present tense is coming we have to change into simple past if present continuous abina we have to change into past continuous so present perfect enna va maru abina past perfect a maru what a beautiful view it is said my friend my friend exclaimed that it was a very beautiful view so veena said to her friend how beautiful your handwriting is adhe mari veena exclaimed said to bala exclaimed aachriyam to her friend that yaroda handwriting ha handwriting how beautiful ya handwriting solra appa avaludaiya ha handwriting was is bala was very beautiful okay va so the traveler said shit i have forgotten to bring my passport okay va have perfect have has vanduchina that is perfect present perfect had abina past perfect solvom liya so the traveler exclaimed with sorrow marandutaanga appa sorrow that he avar sonnaru na sollanum okay va that so have vand present avar the present perfect appa enna vaagunu have had a mari mariru had forgotten okay verb 3 to bring his passport my abina avarudaiyen sollu sollu liya so direct appa direct speech appna avaru engitta solrudu appa na solra appa avar sonnaru nu sonna appa he or his use pandru his passport okay va the player said hurra we have won the match so hurra na exclaimed with joy the players exclaimed joyfully that so we abingirudu they they had won the match okay va so present perfect is changed into past perfect people said alas we have missed our leader idu vandha enadu sorrowful ah solranga so the people exclaimed with sorrow kashtathoda solranga that they veena nam ellarume they had missed their avungaloda leader avar nu solra appo direct ah pesra pa avar appo avanga sonnaanga nu solra pa their avungaloda leader nam solluvom next person kitta solra pa so they are leader okay you have to see Uh, see these small changes while you are changing into indirect indirect speech okay well, have you all understood the four kinds of sentences so statement interrogative imperative exclamatory so how you have to change so if it is simple present you have to change into simple past so present continuous is changed into past continuous present perfect is changed into past perfect okay well, have you all understood this one ma Thank you students